Hello YouTube, this is Robbie Rocket Pants and welcome to I Am Alive. This game came out I th through 2011 I want to say or something, it was a couple, it's a couple of years old. It is a post-apocalyptic survival rock climbing game and you might think to yourself, oh god another survival post-apocalyptic game. No zombies in this, but that doesn't matter. As much as I like zombies, it actually is a uh, it's a very in it has a very interesting game mechanic which you will get to see besides the rock climbing parts of it uh, a very interesting combat mechanic which you will get to see and I'm not going to give too much away if you don't know what this game is I would suggest you watch this because it is it's a pretty cool game and it's 10 bucks on Steam right now I would absolutely advise you get it if you have 10 bones to spare anyway um, Quick update, I haven't been uh, recording in a while, so uh, Bioshock, I'm not sure if I'm going to finish that because everybody's played it and to be honest, recording it got a little boring for me. Alan Wake, I, I was enjoying and I think I'll probably pick that up again at some point. Dead Island, I need my partner to actually play with me if I'm going to finish that and he's a bitch and uh, he keeps procrastinating on playing so I don't know if that's going to happen. And I've got a few other games that I got on Steam lined up. Uh, there's a good summer sale on right now. Uh, also, the Humble Bundles are uh, worth looking at occasionally. So I've got a few things. Some interesting games, possibly, uh, uh, that I'll be recording. Anyway, uh, that's enough. I'm rambling. So let's do this. Let's do it. I am alive. Are you? Are you, though? We'll see. That was a really stupid joke. All right. Come on, then. Let's do it. Onwards. found this, then that means... Anyway, if you could try to deliver this video recorder to my home. That's in Haventon, 27 Arbor Street. It's right in front of the park, and, well, um, maybe, just maybe, someone will be there. Okay, this is basically my life. My backpack, climbing harness, a flashlight, a couple of batteries, a pistol. I've never even fired a gun before. Anyway, there aren't any bullets in it, so... I can't believe I'm about to arrive. It's been almost a year now since the event. It only took me four hours to fly out east. But the better part of a year to walk home. With any luck, I'll be back at our apartment in another couple of hours. I saw a lot of damage on the way here, but this looks different. There's more dust than anywhere I've seen. I wonder what it looks like inside the city. I know it's crazy, but I, I just have this feeling that I'll find you. Julie, without you and Mary, none of this makes any sense. Almost home. See you soon. Our apartment is still there. Probably not. So, yeah, there we go. So this is the game then. It looks pretty, looks pretty cool. I'm not sure about the um, the character models. Actually, he looks a bit funky. But uh, yeah, kind of grainy. It's pretty cool. Um, right trigger. I'm using a mouse. What are you talking about? Oh, brilliant. Hold on. Don't tell me I've got it set to... No, this isn't going to be good. 
No control settings. Use gamepad off. Yes. How do I sprint then? Shift. Haven't in traffic. No, oh, no, I missed it. Haven't in, and I don't think that it ever really explicitly says. Oh, whoops. Explicitly says where Haven't in is. But uh, oh, game doesn't want me to go that way. I want to say it's something like Chicago or something like that. So, um, so the setup then is that there's been some sort of event, but not really sure what exactly. There's a lot of dust though. All right. Yes, I see. Uh huh. And so on the left there, you'll see uh, that's basically my stamina, which I need for climbing. Uh, yeah, it's telling me right now. For climbing and for. Uh, wait a minute. Can I climb up here? Oh god. Oh, I think I already fucked up. Oh, I want to get up there though. Alright, so this is going to be a good opportunity to show you what happens when you fuck up. Where do I go? Now, here's the problem. I'm going to run out of stamina pretty soon. Ooh. Okay. That was a little... That was a little close. It's really hard to play and talk at the same time. Uh... My mouse click. Um, so yeah, so I've got stamina on the left and then my health is on the right and if I begin to lose... when I run out of stamina when I'm climbing I start to take damage basically and I'll also lose my grip. There's a good chance that's going to happen later. Not so much right now because it's the beginning of the game but Uh, huh. And huh. I have to. It's really you have to be really careful. You have got to remember what the controls are. Like I'll have to climb over those arch supports. It's very easy to forget what button you have to press and accidentally press a button that basically just plunges you into the abyss. <laughs> beautiful graphics. Beautiful. Climbing instantly burns, yes, I know that. Now the cool thing is you also get this representation of your stamina running out by uh, it, uh, the music kind of picks up a little, just kind of neat. Nope, how do I get down? I forgot. There we go. So this is, it's a little bit, you'll see later with the combat, the way that that works, oh, wait a minute, that uh, it's very, um, how on earth am I going to do this? Oh shit, where do I go? Can I go faster? I'm going to die. What am I going to do? Oh, shit. Oh, boy. Ooh. Now then, so... Oh, uh, that's right. So you lose... Uh, available stamina by doing stupid shit like that. Yes, I know. Now, that will replace, that's going to replace, now the thing is, you'll notice here, look, it replaces health and stamina 
at the same time. Two stamina, two health. The problem with me using this is that I'm using the only thing that I have that can help me with health. This water bottle will replace some of my stamina, but not very much. So what do I do? I'm just going to use the water, I think, for now. I don't want to waste all of that. So let's continue. And hopefully I won't fuck up again. Well, it's still standing. Though Abington has seen better days. Although I might have to take that uh, canned fruit or whatever it was. Again. The only thing I find a little bit annoying when your stamina is low, as it is now, is that that music continues. Whee! Oh man, that's gotta hurt. Look at this thing. Like solid metal. What's that? Pick up the pizza, man. No? Whoa. Right. Uh. Okay. Over the bus, I guess. Yeah. Why didn't I just go over the bus in the first place? Couldn't I have just climbed over the bus? It looks like I was supposed to do that. I can't jump that, surely. No, it's not even going to let me. Well... Do I climb on the car? Can I do that? Nope. Alright, I'm confused. Ooh. Hello? Painkillers, what does that do? Probably health, right? So that's all... Okay, so now I'm going to use this because I've got something that can heal health, so... There we go, alright. Back to good old new me. I'm new again! doesn't help with where I have to go though. Seriously, what do I do? Oh wait, here we go. Uh, this way? Oh. Yeah, that makes sense. Whoa. Any goodies? Hmm? Nothing? What was that? Huh? Look at... Interesting. Let's go around the circle. Can't we take one of these, though? There's probably all kinds of cool stuff in here. Guns and whatnot. Well, I can't... Huh. There's a ladder on that truck. There is. It doesn't look like it's... I like how he's like, yeah, we'll just get on the, the, the truck that's swinging precariously off a, off a precipice. Guess we don't have much choice though, do we? Very square. Drop down, dude! Okay. Thankfully, it doesn't let you fall. You. <laughs> oh. Whoa. I didn't notice this. Holy shit. That probably was not there before. I'm guessing. The giant gaping hole. 20,000 leagues under the sea. Oops. I keep pressing. A... I have this problem with every game I play. I always press the wrong button. And jump. Nicely done. I don't know what this guy's name is, I forgot already. 
Oh god. And up. See, there I would press the right mouse button and fall to my death, tip usually. Yeah. Is that a headless corpse? It is. Oh, there's the head. Hello. Alas, poor Yorick. Sorry, that was a Shakespeare reference. I grew up near uh, Shakespeare's birthplace, so that's my excuse. Too much exposure to all that shit. Right then. And up! Yes. And up again. Oh, I'm getting the hang of this now. And up. It looks, it looks a little simple at the moment, but trust me, it gets, gets a lot more interesting later. As well as the combat, which will probably get back up to the streets if I go I through the we'll sewer. Probably get to round about now. I believe. Hello, hello, anybody? Is anybody here? Oh, what's this? Oh, you got retries as well. Which is basically like saves. You have to find them. It's like the uh, the ribbons in uh, Resident Evil. Right then, the sewers. Hey, who's that? Oh shit! I don't around. want any trouble. I'm already gone. Now. Get back, or you're right, right. get shot. Okay, okay, okay. Yeah, I'm backing up. Now the interesting thing is, is if I did approach him, he probably would shoot me. And as you can see, in the top you, right. Don't even think about coming back. All right, all right. That's it. Just keep right on walking. In the top right corner, I don't have any ammo, so I can't shoot him. And don't come back. This is not an appropriate time to show you what actually happens if I do point my gun at him. There's a lot of dust down there. Mm -hmm. Pretty thick. Thick like a village idiot. So... Yeah. That, that guy's looked better, I think. Um... I get, do we go down there? I don't think we do. Doesn't look like we should go down there. Can I climb up here? Oh. What? You know what, just for the hell of it, I might point my gun at... No, because he's just going to... If I point my gun at him, he will shoot me. And I don't really have any way of oops, defending myself, so... Alright, dude. Relax, man. I'm, I'm out of here, don't worry. Jesus. Oh. Yeah, people aren't uh, aren't really very nice. All right, so I want to go over there. I do kind of want to scavenge a little bit though and see what I can find in terms of. Whoops, not not the big hole though. Don't go down there. I need to find uh, basically more resources. And also my map updates to show me where I cannot go, which is sort of helpful. Oh, I see something. What do we have here? Oh, a retry. Pressing the wrong button, I keep pressing uh, spacebar for spring. I could force open this gate with something. Uh, what the hell do you think you're doing? You just now this is interesting. About, huh? Got it. 
So now do this. Hey, hey wait, wait, no. Hey, back up. Uh, okay. Well, I tell him to back the fuck up. Back up, bro. I'm not worth a bullet. Back. No, no problem. Please, I'm trapped. Hey, uh. ah! Yes. And the machete. Hello. Better keep this with me. Hmm. Better leave this where I found it, just in case this guy comes back. Uh, in case he comes back for it. But no, he's down there. He's dead. Or at least he has seen better days. Oh shit! How do I get to that? I need whatever that is. I want it. I want it. I need it. I can't get to it. I think I have to go around. Apologies if you can hear them, all this mouse clicking going on. Oh uh, shit. What the hell do you think you're doing? Okay. Yeah, this is where it gets a little hairy because... I don't really have any way of defending myself, so... Oh, and I got a bullet. Hey, no more messing around. I'm at your mercy. Now you're mine. Yo. No, no, please. Oh, fuck. I oh, fucking shot that guy. You bitch. Ugh. Ouch. But well, I got hurt in the process. Well. Murder. There you go. Murder. In Haverton. Or Haverton. I can't remember which it is now. So that's basically the combat. A little tease for you. Pretty much, you uh, you kind of want to sort of manage who you take on and when and how. If that <laughs> that sounds like most combat, really, doesn't it? But because of the fact that you, I mean, sometimes you'll come across, you know, three or four guys, and you don't even have any ammo at all. The cool thing in the game, though, is that they don't know if you've got ammo or not so you're pointing a gun at them and they're kind of like mm, well he might have ammo or he might not and um so you're kind of it's a bit of a you're playing mind games with them which is is very interesting I've never really ever played a game where that's sort of the main focus of the of the combat it's like intimidating your enemy in that in that way Definitely want to go and get whatever that is. It looks tasty. It was a health. Oh, I probably need some health, don't I? Well, let's take the painkillers and leave that other one for later. Hold on, did I get everything I want from over there? Didn't really check around much. Anything? I think we're pretty... No, I can't go in there. So, um... So yeah, so you want to use a combo... A combination of intimidation with uh, a weapon. And also your... Uh, And uh, your machete, which you can use to surprise the shit out of people. Oops. Now before I go, I think I have to go... The... Wait, who's that? Check that noise out. These guys. Who are you? Whoa. He's my son. They stabbed him. Oh uh, yeah, now He's what do I get? Death if we can't find something to treat this wound. Now here's an interesting conundrum that you also have faced in this game. What do I do? I've got one health pack left. That's all I have on me. But I could give it to this guy. Now I think what I get out of this is a retry. 
but I probably don't need retries right now. Now, do I want... <laughs> the thing is, do I want to be... Is it about what I get out of this, or is it simply that I'm going to be a nice guy and give him the health pack anyway? I don't really need the retry, and probably right now I don't really need the health either. Having said that, do I want to give up my only health pack? I think the answer is no. Sorry, you're on your own. Motherfucker. Are you going for help? Yes, I'm going for help. I'm lying. I'm not really going for help. I'm going to leave you to die. Sorry. Can I go over this? It's probably a bit too high. Yep. Where's that, uh, I want to find that, uh, that area that I could see from around the corner. Actually, I think, I think actually, I'm going, this is the direction that Who I... Who are you? You asked me that when I passed you the first time. You have a very short memory, lady. Oh. Uh, yes, here we go. Yep. Soda, what does that do? Full stamina, oof, nice. See, and this gives me full... So giving away one of those is a bit... It's like, hmm... That's a full... That is full recovery of my health. Just given away to some... Random stranger. Who are you? Shut up. Oh, I can't pull my gun on... They stabbed him. He's gonna bleed to death if we can't find something to treat this Yeah, way. I heard this sub story already. Yes. No, I'm not. We've established this already. Did I already go... Wait. Hey, no. Don't mess around, son. What? Who, me? Who is that? Oh, hello. What have you got there? Now, I don't have any ammo, so I... I mean, I could... I think if I... Oh, alright, 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 okay, okay, okay. I think... I think she'll shoot me if I get too close. To, I can't get close enough to actually stab her. I tried this before. It does not work. Oh, fuck. But look at the details, though. It's I mean, it's really cool. All the dust everywhere, and... I mean, the graphics could be a little bit better. I like that everything's kind of blown out as well, because it uh, really gives it a sense of this sort of... I don't know, like a, almost like a nuclear like a nuclear explosion feel to it. I want to say also in the story that it's never really determined... I'm not coming back. It's never really determined exactly what happened. The only problem with all, all these areas is that I get a bit confused. Like, did I have already been here? I've not been here before. I remember there being more resources though around here. I think I must be crazy. Maybe I should give that health back away. No, I'm not going to. Not yet. Not just yet. I thought there was body parts. Gross. They're not though. That, those are body parts. Nasty. He needs to do some... That guy needs to do his laundry. Well, the apartment's still standing. That's a good sign. Wasn't sure I'd ever see this place again. Before I go in there, I just want to check... around... because... there's got to be some resources somewhere. Oh, fucking hell. Or not. Am I just crazy? I thought that there was like tons of junk around everywhere. I'm gonna go in here and get mobbed, aren't I? Yeah, I need... That's a little weird. Who's folding their clothes neatly during the apocalypse? I probably would though, I'm a bit anal about that sort of thing. Not so much about folding my clothes, but neatness. Mind you, it probably keeps you sane, though, in a situation like this. You're thinking, well, the world's gone to hell. What can I do to make it just a little bit more tolerable? And I would say, yeah, folding your trousers might help. 
No? Maybe? Ow, what was that? Why did I get hurt then? What was that? I don't understand what that does. It's like a speed boost, but it's a bit... Music's a bit dramatic at times. Have I been down here? What it is is I'm running out of stamina, but... Nope. I think these these areas get opened up later on. Alright, I'm just going to go to the apartment and then I might... I think I might end the video at this point. This is a sort of introduction to I'm alive. What you could expect to happen. Home sweet home. Mary? Julie? Are you there? There's no one here. I remember that day. What's this? We have to go now because of the earthquakes. The evacuation team is waiting for us. We'll be taken to one of the emergency shelters. It's very hard to get precise information about the evacuation plan. I have no idea where we'll be in the next hour. If only you were here. I would tell you that I forgive you. For everything. For now, all we can do is pray that you're alive. And if you are, I know you'll come back here. We'll try to stay in Haventon, but we'll go wherever's safest. With Mary, I can't take any risks. We love you. Not a moment goes by that we're not thinking about you. Try to find us. We'll be waiting for you. Julia Mary, May 23rd.